Day two at Indo Defense 2016 in Jakarta. Today we're focusing on the international presence. Last uh, Indo Defense, Rheinmetall presented the Marder APC, and consequently we have now a new variant, um, as there is a requirement for a medium MBT here in Indonesia. So we took the Marder chassis, which is also fielded now in Indonesia due to the contract we have fulfilled, and we integrated a 105 mm turret, Otto Melara turret, a typical three-man turret, commander, gunner, and, and a loader. And this is the first prototype. So the advantage of this concept is that uh, we use the fielded Marder, so that is the same logistic, it's the same training for the driver and uh, we integrate a well-proven uh, modern turret. So that means this solution is available in a very short time and a very effective price and especially very low logistic footprint. That is also very important. Simple operation and uh, easy to maintain. Yeah, what we have here is the RB70NG uh, air defense uh, missile system. It's not actually not integrated yet, but we are cooperating with the local company PT Pindad for a vehicle integration on this type of, of uh, vehicle produced by, by PT Pindad. And uh, what we have here is just a demonstrator. Uh, what we are working on is with a vehicle installation where we have a foldable stand, so you can have a transport position to have it more in a secure transport mode. The system is an, an, an enhancement of the previous RB70 system where we have a, now a built-in thermal imager and we have an automatic tracking system which makes it very easy to use, easy also to, to train operators to handle the system and due to this auto tracking we have an enhanced performance uh, with our missiles. So we have an effective range in excess of 9 km. Uh, and you have a, a capability to engage everything from aircraft, helicopters, UAVs, uh, cruise missiles or even uh, armor targets on the ground due to the combined warhead of the missile. This is what you see, this is our Giraffe 1X, our expand uh, radar for uh, short range. So this is the land-based version, it comes also in a sea-based version. And it's a system that we offer together with the RBS 70 ng in a V-shore application, together with our local partner, PT Pindad. And we are offering the complete V-shore system with sensor, C2, weapon terminals, firing unit, missiles and vehicles. And together with this also a logistics package. In this course, we show to Norinco most of the uh, advanced air defense system. This system named the Sky Dragon Middle Range Missile Surface to Air. Uh, in this system, including three types of uh, vehicle. Uh, the first one is a commanding commanding vehicle. Second one is a missile missile launcher vehicle. The last one is a long range searching radar. Uh, I think for our system, the most advantage, uh, such as the middle the range, firing, firing range, uh, for missile, the maximum range reach up to uh, 50 kilometer, yes. And also in this missile, equipped, equipped with a uh, mu uh, much advantage technology, such as the uh, guidance seeker. The seeker is a full automatic radar guidance. Uh, different with some other uh, production, just uh, semi-automatic. But uh, our Sky Dragon is uh, full automatic. Yes, first one. The second one is uh, uh, in our vehicle. It can guidance guided uh, missile in one time, 12, 12 rounds. Yes, 12 rounds. Today on this uh, specific occasion. 
uh, we are pleased to present this uh, tank boat because it's a CMI turret which is on, uh, on this uh, vessel. So the turret is a 105 caliber. It's uh, the Cockrell gun on this, so it's a uh, high pressure, low recoil uh, turret, which we already produce and equipped uh, for some program in the, in the Middle East and uh, in some European program as well. Uh, it has a good level of maturity. It was developed four years ago, and now in Tuermo is, is produced industrially. Uh, this turret is a little bit specific uh, because we have to take into account the fact that it goes on a ship and a vessel. So the stabilization has been improved and the maritimization has been improved also in order to have good corrosion uh, properties and to be sure that all the parts are well isolated, insulated from any water damage or potential water damage. Next Tour of France is showcasing its artillery solutions as well as its robotic systems. So this robot, the name of this robot is uh, Nerva LG. So it's a multi-purpose robot. Uh, so it can be used uh, by police or defense uh, for several applications. Uh, so it's uh, highly versatile. Uh, it can be uh, configured with different modules for surveillance, counter ID, including combat uh, too. And, um, so it's a multi-purpose robot. So the benefit uh, is mainly it's high modularity, so modularity of payload, but modularity about mobility too. At the moment, the robot is equipped with wheels, so it's very robust, so it's very easy to transport in a backpack, for example, but you can also equip the robot with tracks or different kind of wheels. So when the robot is equipped with these wheels, it can move like a crab, you know, like this. Of course, you can move as usual, so you can rotate too. When you equip the robot uh, with both these wheels um, and a special camera, so like this one, uh, so this is a camera which looks up. Uh, so when the robot is equipped in such a way, so it will be very easy to insp inspect under uh, cars. This, you can switch a light on on the robot. Um, here you have the view of the, the robot, so you imagine you can check under a car and so with this kind of view, it's very easy when you combine this kind of movement, very easy to inspect the car. Of course you can take pictures and check very easily if there is any suspect object.